Hello and welcome to Barnik Smart Online Class. I am Brecher. Today I have come with a new short video that is the position of an adverb. In this chapter, we will learn where we should use an adverb. First concept, remember, an adverb is used after intransitive verb. It means, jadi tamay gorchi intransitive verb pauja sentence re, tale adverb ta ko intransitive verb pare vasebo. So now question comes, what is an intransitive verb? And I am sure everyone already knows what is an intransitive verb. An intransitive verb is a verb which does not take an object. Je object carry kari na thay. So jadi tamay intransitive verb pauja intransitive verb ra pare, tamay gorde adverb ta ko put kari bo. Now read this sentence. Here I have mentioned he soundly slept last night. That means here soundly is an adverb, slept is an intransitive verb. Mark karo, it is soundly tako slept purbor use hechi, that's why it is considered incorrect. But if you read the second sentence, it is the correct one. Why? Because soundly is used after slept or after intransitive verb. Clear? Again, read this sentence. He returned immediately. Return is an intransitive verb and immediately is an adverb. So, it is intransitive verb with the verb, immediately lako for a use kali. Now come to the next point, where an adverb should be used after intransitive verb. In, sorry, after transitive verb. Transitive verb for a adverb ta kote basi ba. Remember, transitive verb bro, tume chahi le before basi hai pari ba, ki ba transitive verb plus object ta pare bhi tume chahi le gode adverb ko basi hai pari ba. Kaur, na an adverb is used after transitive verb, plus object or before transitive verb. Read this sentence. He briefly narrated the incident to me. Briefly is an adverb of manner. He briefly narrated. Narrated is what? It's a transitive verb. The incident, it's an object. So they call it a transitive verb. This is the correct one. Now read this second sentence. He narrated to me the incident. Narrated is a transitive verb. The incident is an object. Now briefly, object for a basiche. Clear line nine. Now move to our next rule, next point. Remember, <coughs> uh, an adverb is used in the middle of an auxiliary and main verb in the middle of the two auxiliary verbs. That means, jadi sentence re, to me dita auxiliary pauchha. To dita auxiliary majhire to me adverb ta ko put kari ba. Or if you are getting two adverbs, sorry, two verbs, one is auxiliary verb, second is main verb, then I am adverb taku, auxiliary or main verb ra, mid re insert kara chupo. Now read this sentence, he will always be happy. Here, will is a uh, more auxiliary verb, be is also a auxiliary verb. So it is adverb taku always asila, ka majhira basi chupo, will out be majhira basila. So he will certainly miss, will is an auxiliary verb, miss. What a kind of chipile? Now, miss a tick on a chip, but a main verb. The auxiliary verb, a main verb, majority con a chip, now that is adverb. Clear pile? But this rule has some exception. We can use, we can apply this rule with all auxiliaries except often, sorry, except have to and used to. A have to or used to. Purbor hi adverb ta ko use kar thao. Mark karo, I often have to go to school on food. Here often ta go de adverb, that is adverb of frequency. A adverb of frequency ta ko mo kothi use kar chhi, na have to da purbor use kar chhi. Jadi tumhe lekha hai tante ki, I have to often go to school on food, then this sentence will be considered as incorrect. The same way, tumhe yidhi lekhi ba, she used to always agree with me, that it would be wrong. It should be, she always used to agree with me. Clear? Well, now come to another rule that is adverb of frequency. Jadi sentence re adverb of frequency paucha, like always raila, never raila, often raila, usually raila, sometimes raila. Tale, conquer your ruchi. Now try to put that adverb between an auxiliary verb and main verb. Tamin adverb of frequency taku, auxiliary verb or main verb module insert kara. If there is no auxiliary verb, then Try to put it between subject and its main verb. 
Now read the first example. He has never seen a tiger. He has never seen a tiger. Never got a adverb of frequency. Has got a auxiliary verb. Seen is a main verb. So he has never seen a tiger. That means here I put an adverb of frequency between auxiliary verb and main verb. Now read this sentence. We usually meet. Usually is an adverb. We is a subject. Meet is a main verb. So, J2 is an auxiliary verb. Nahi, ame le, ame add le between subject and verb, main verb. Chire, add verb ta ko add le. Clear? Now, move to our next concept. That is, when an adverb modifies an adjective or another adverb, the adverb usually comes before it. As a common concept. Good adverb, good adjective could modify curipare, or good adverb could modify curipare. So remember, jo adverb the modify coche, it should come before that adverb or that adjective. Say adjective or adverb purbur was yagata. Jemtiki, the mango you bought was quite right. The mango you brought was quite right. The quite is an adverb, right is an adjective. So, ripe ko modify kara uchi, then quite a kapur ripe purbur basila. He spoke very loudly, loudly good adverb, very big good adverb. Jetu, verita, loudly ko modify, loud, loudly ko modify kochi, then verita, loudly purbur basche. But, exception case file, ame enough soita python. Enough hochi good adverb, jota ki jahaku modify kotibota, pore basibo, naki, tab purburu. Jemdiki, she spoke loud, loud tauchi. She spoke loud enough. Loud taku loud taku enough modify kochi. It have enough loud like you ni loud enough like a chiba. Even secondary they call his intelligent enough. Intelligent adjective also chi taku modify uchi, but enough intelligent habani rather intelligent enough haba. Clear. Next now. <coughs> But important concept will be tomorrow is for exam rate as the jetabari to me more than one adverb voucher like adverb of manner pile or place pile or time pile or after an object tale monroko to me are order ta kon hava na first to me manner karibo tapre place lekhibo tapre time lekhibo that means first manner then place then time so this order can be said mpt Makara, she sang well at the concert yesterday. She sang how well, well is manner. Where at the concert, it's a place. When, like the yesterday. So, Mukham Dilekhele, I mention it in NPT format. Now, he wrote the letter, how swiftly, where at home, when yesterday. That means, whenever you find any uh, more than one adverb, like the place, manner, time. They should be arranged in MPT order. Okay. Here we have also some exceptions. Like if you find any moving ad moving verb, the moving verb like the go rahila, move rahila, come ki fly rahila, then the order should be PMT. PMT means first we should use place, then manner, then time. Remember with the moving verb. Jo verb move ko ba action ko refers ko thuba. The boy went home. The ko went ta ko moving verb go ko puchhela. Mu quickly lekhli ni. The boy went where? Home lekhli. Then quickly, quickly mane manner lekhli. Yesterday mane time lekhli. First place, manner, time. Again, he moved to Mumbai last night. He moved to Mumbai. Mumbai ta kono file? Place, last night ta time ko puchhela. Third re lekhli. The boys entered. How? Silently. It's a manner. Where? The classroom. So, first manner, tapre place. So, what a concept clear here? First, janle MPT, then janle PMT. PMT with the moving verb. Now, jedi tamay sentence re frequency paucho. That means place pilo, frequency pilo, time pilo. Time adverb pilo, tahale tumay kong karibo. The order should be PFT. PFT in the sense, first, should be place, then F equal to frequency, then equal to time. That means he comes here, he comes where? Place that is here. Where? So how many times? How often? That is two times. That is frequency. When? Timing in a way. So order should be PFT. Clear play? That means Amoko 
adverb jodi if we are finding more than one adverb in a sentence after object we must use it in mpt pmt and pft hope everybody understands the position of an adverb hope this video will be more informative for all of you aur jo mano ko videos ta bhalo lagu chu pile kindly share it with your friends and subscribe our channel thank you